Hi, this is Mac with Max Garage. Today we're featuring this 1950 GMC half ton school bus. Look at this bad boy. It's even got a grill. Oh my word, I didn't know it had a grill and a front bumper. Hmm, nice. I bought this, bought this old school bus out of Pueblo, Colorado. And, and uh, I know I'm going to get half a dozen people that's going to say, Oh, that ain't, a, that ain't a school bus. It's a Suburban. Yeah, but you'd be wrong. Um, there, is a, there is a body sticker in here. This, uh, this uh, panel was converted by, I believe it is Fisher, Fisher Bus Company. As you can see, it has a seat there along the side that they installed. The kids got to sit on these seats. Isn't that sweet? Of course, these panels make great storage areas. Doesn't have a headliner. They didn't have anything like that. Uh, the uh, the back doors are currently on it, but given time. Mm, I've had people borrowing things, so as you can see, there we go, last stickered in 67 as a farm truck. Oh yeah, it's got the deluxe tail light, and looks pretty good overall, really. Probably had some school bus flashers here, you know, and... Let's open it up and look in here. It does have latches. It does have... I was trying to, was trying to remember where the... Because I have seen the uh, plaque in here that tells who made this bus. And you know what? Wow, I'm sorry, but I can't remember where it's at now that I said that. Uh, but it there is one in here somewhere. Well, not too much to show here. Looks like the glass on that side's gone, but the glass over here is broken. Well, yay. And it also looks like the bottom, the bottom bench seat is gone. Bottom of the bench seat uh, for the school bus is gone, but that could be easily fabricated. It make a very unusual ride. I. I don't know that I've ever seen another one, to be real honest with you. I mean, let's go this way. Hey, back doors are pretty straight. Top's pretty straight. Pretty straight overall. Got a little bit of cancer in the usual places on these, but it's not real bad. Colorado's usually been a very dry state, so uh, there, is a, there is a drive train in this, and it's the original six, and I can't get the hood open and do this camera, so I'm not even going to try. Uh, but I tell you what is listed on Antique Auto and if I find that uh, sticker of the uh, bus manufacturer, I, I believe it's either Fisher or Bluebird, then I'll take a snapshot and post it on AntiqueCar.com. Hey, this is Mac with Max Garage, 50 school bus, over and out, see you down the road.